Hey there guys, today I am gonna show you Android Lollipop on the Moto E. Here you can see the lock screen modified in the Android L and bringing down once you can get access to the quick settings and the quick toggles. Pull up to unlock the screen. Here you can see the Android Lollipop home screen and pull down once to get access to the notifications and twice to get to the quick settings and the quick toggles once again. And here you can see Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, the networks, throat rate, auto rotate in the sense and car screen is also available. Okay, let's go to the settings and let me show you the exact version of Android Lollipop on my Moto E. Let's go to about phone and there you can see Android 5.0.2. Tapping on it multiple times can get you access to the easter egg, the new easter egg in the sense on the Lollipop. Tapping the Lollipop for few times would lead you to the game that is provided these days. The game particularly resembles Flappy Bird which you must have played. Let's go back and let me show you a few more features of the Android app. So, let me take you to the battery section which has been enhanced by the powerful Project Volta. Battery backup has always been a phenomenon in the Moto E but it has been improved by the battery saver also provided by the Google and certain levels at 5% of battery and 15% of battery. Okay, let's turn on the battery saver mode. Oh, I don't like it at all because of the theme it has provided. So let's turn it off. And let's go back and show you some more of the features on the Android L. So here you can see the menu. The menu has never been changed since the KitKat version on the Moto E and also the widgets page is further related. Let's go to the recent menus. The new recent look is very impressive these days. And you can also open the Google Now by just swapping up the home button from any screen as you see. Let's go back to the recents. Here you can see there are multiple Chrome tabs also open as each individual tabs of the Chrome browser. Now let's go and I'll show you screen pinning. Pin Google. You can see that green symbol out there. Stop it once. It will ask you and just pin. Screen is pinned. Or to unpin it, press the back and the recents button together. Dismiss the notifications, just swipe it away. That was the Motorola Moto E 1.2 GHz Qualcomm Snapdragon dual core Adreno 305 GPU, 1GB RAM, and 4GB of ROM, and a 4.3 inch QHD screen. Thanks for watching our videos, guys. Please do like, comment, and subscribe to our channel.